guys, this is Delta 6. Thank you for joining us on another video. Um, so this is gonna go off of the, the video that we just posted. We're still at the parade, but I wanted to kind of go a little bit more into detail of what we do during parades. Um, so when we're on parades, when we first get here during the staging process, we're looking at, um, for anything that is a threat, you know, people walking up with bags, anything that looks like they might have weapons on them or anything suspicious. We're also um, smelling for certain smells like hay, things of that nature. If you don't know what the smell of hay is, um, that guys is um, for like dirty bombs, things of that nature. That's one of those, those smells that you want to look out for. Um, you want to look out for unusual packages, backpacks, things of that nature. And, you know, just continue that process throughout the entire parade during the staging. And once the parade starts to move, what I do and my officers do, um, and Eric, we scan not just the crowd that is on the side sidelines waiting for beads and things like that to be thrown, but we're looking for um, anybody that doesn't look like they're having a good time those are one of those key things that if they're not having a good time, they might be up to no good. Um, they might want to cause harm or do something that they shouldn't be doing. So we're looking for stuff like that. Um, other than that, guys, we're looking at the rooftops. I don't know if you can see over here. So we're looking at rooftops, windows, um, people hanging you know, out of them. Um, we're looking for muzzles of rifles, things of that nature. And that is um, important to do because if they have the higher ground, they're already at a big advantage, right? And like I said, the members of crew of Sir Francis Drake, um, there's a lot of high people, um, doctors, some politicians, you have some people that work for NATO. Um, there's a lot of people that bad people might want to take out or um, kidnap, things of that nature. So we look at all the possibilities that we physically can. We look at um, the rig that pulls the float, see if there's anything unusual there. You know, we're used to looking at the hydraulics, the hoses underneath the wheel well, underneath the uh, rig itself, and then underneath the float. And every time there's a new bag, we count the bags. We actually have a process where we get different color tags and we have the members of the crew tag them as well and what that does is it, it allows us to spot out bags that are not meant to be there um, so if today the color was orange on those tags for instance we would look to make sure all those bags have orange any bag that doesn't we're going to search carefully and see if there's anything unusual in that bag um, and then from there guys we continue through the parade we're still scanning we're looking at windows rooftops um, we're constantly scanning around, looking at threats. We're also looking behind us and we're watching the crew members because, you know, on the floats, you know, sometimes on a, other crews or, or anything like that, um, you know, they might have technical issues, mechanical issues, the brakes might not work. Um, the width of the street might get narrow and they might get squished in between the fence and the actual float or the rig itself. So we're, we're constantly um, moving, you know, it's not just hanging out and chilling. We're, you know, making sure that not just our crew is safe, but other crews as well. So when we walk around, we're looking for suspicious activity on their floats or around their floats and also around the sidewalk areas that we're gonna be going through when the parade actually starts. Uh, but that's it for this one, guys. If y'all guys do parades or anything like that, maybe this video might help you guys um and like i said it's it's a fun time to do these parades um you know the year's kicking off and we're going to be doing a lot more of them so hopefully we'll have some video footage for you guys um but you know i really just wanted to make this video to see if this helps you guys to an extent where if y'all guys get a parade contract or you're working a parade then maybe you guys would be able to um you know know what to look out for and what to do um, but it looks like I'm being called to uh, take care of something real quick. Thank you for joining us again. Please hit that like, share, subscribe. 
Leave some comments down below. Tell me what you think about it, what you do, if you guys do work parades. And until next time, guys, be safe. God bless.